So what's up? We are here for Spidey's Homecoming. I'm very excited. I've been hearing very like awesome good things about it. Looking forward to it. I think the villain's a lot better than previous stuff, so expectations, expectations. I think mean, Holland proved himself in Civil War, so at least the very least, Holland's gonna be fine. Superman, Spider-Man, whoa. And then uh, we have, you know, Stark and Aunt May, they're fine. Um, wonder how the rest of the school kids are gonna be like. And I mean, Michael Keaton as Birdman. I mean, Vulture, really, that's just awesome. I wonder how the other sort of lower tier villains, we got Shocker. The Tinkerer, I think, is in this, or some other people. But overall, lots of expectations. We're just curious and excitement going in, so definitely cannot wait. I mean, I don't know, it's been good, a lot of hearing good things, so what, what else can I expect but good things? Anyway, this is before and this is after. Solid, solid Spider-Man comeback. Everything I really enjoyed. Villain, characters, new concepts of like pre-existing characters, action sequences, whole story arc really great stuff cgi great tony stark i think i don't know i heard complaints that he was into too much but i actually dug it and just just like i love the, like the whole school part about how he's always at school and then he disappears and doing all these like school things loved it and um the whole liz thing the twist my birdman was amazing not amazing but it was pretty decent the whole I'm a hero in my own villain story, but you know, you sort of relate and all that stuff. So enjoyed it. And yeah, definitely looking forward to how he's gonna come back in Avengers 3 and 4 and then his own sequel. And I really enjoyed it. I mean, Holland, good stuff. Sure, Aunt May has less screen time. Uh, definitely gonna look forward to what's happening. I mean, I'm totally excited, pumped, uh, solid film, pacing actually didn't feel long i mean sure it was sort of like generic you knew what kind of arc it was going and then like see trailers sort of you know what's hasn't happened so you know what's going to come up next but still really enjoyed it and and just it's just, it's like things that were like issues in the f previous five spider-mans fixed we have like sort of constipated face again but filmed differently and then also whole fairy thing was also cool i mean like Everything was great, like power sets, skill sets, suits, really enjoyed it. I mean, definitely dig where it's going. I definitely need to go back and watch the director's previous film with uh, Kevin Bacon, Cop Car. Gonna check that out for sure. I mean, it's, it's, it was, well, this was a good time and definitely glad I came out and checked it out on the big screen. So it, it's funny also, like the, the comedy is also, I think I enjoyed it as well. And uh, Captain America cameo is pretty funny as well. So yeah, as always, stay behind. People are still leaving, which is, I guess just don't care. Because I mean, I, I think about it. Like if you don't see these sort of end credit scenes in the theater, you're not gonna see it when you go watch the DVD or are you gonna watch the DVD? I don't know. Anyways, enjoyed Homecoming, check it out. So that was uh, before and after of Spider-Man Homecoming. Later.